Hey guys, I'm Angelique. Welcome back. Trends Sparkle. I'm going to show you one of the things that I love to make for lunch, but you could make this for dinner too. Very, very, very easy. Kind of a riff on um, a Mexican bowl like we've made before. Like you get Chipotle or something, but this is more of a Mediterranean style. I copied it from a restaurant I went to and I make it all the time. So easy and just couldn't be healthier. So the first thing I start with is a big pile of lettuce. I love arugula. Said it before, has a ton of vitamins. It's great for you, it has a nice peppery taste. And you can eat an entire bag of like 25 calories, it's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. so, the darker the lettuce, the better for you. Yeah, absolutely. So pile it on. You want to load up with the things that are very low in calories so you feel like you have a lot of food. Yeah, it's filling then that way too. Yeah, so I put a whole bunch of arugula in there, okay? And the next time I'm gonna do a little bit of brown rice. Not a ton of brown rice. I don't have a problem with carbs, but I don't want to use all my calories on them. So I want to use my brown rice as like a condiment, really. Kind of, you know, like we would like a crouton. Just to make our, our salad filling. And yeah, and it tastes good. good. I like the chicken oh, rice. It tastes good. Well, it tastes good. Yeah. It tastes good. And I want things to taste good. So I'm going to put a little bit in, you know, maybe a quarter cup or so. Not a ton. It's all going to get mixed in. You're going to mix this into one big mush and it's going to look maybe not great. But it'll taste wonderful. <laughs> it'll look great. <laughs> okay, and then I have a whole variety of things to put in. And you could do even more than this. Here I have cucumber, chopped pickle, which almost seems a little weird, but it's so good. Oh, I so love good. pickle. I agree. Um, red onion, some cooked chicken. I usually have chicken breast in my fridge that I've made for my family, and I just chop that up mm -hmm. and have it left over. It's really good to have chicken breast on hand and cook. Yeah. If you buy a big bas a big thing of it, just make it all. Make it all, you know, grill it in your fridge. Know, season it after the fact, different flavors. Whatever. Yeah, yeah it's snack on for it. Yeah. And you could add some bell peppers to this. You could add tomato. You could add herbs. You could add anything. But this is usually my base. I have it in my fridge most of the time. This is usually what I do. And it's all going to go in. All right. right. Angela, to throw it all in there. Okay. Right now, our salad is still a little bit dry. I don't want it to be dry. I want it to be, you know, nice and moist and tasty. I'm going to throw some garbanzo beans in. Again, not a ton. Um, great These fiber. High protein. Great fiber. Yeah. Great fiber. And they taste good. So I rinsed them off just right over can. A few of those in there. Okay, and then to make it for our kind of our dressing in our bowl, even though I don't know if I'd call this a salad, I have our shredded sparkle dressing that we showed you how to make in a different video. I will look that up. I'm just gonna whisk that up and put a little bit on. Sometimes I just use balsamic vinegar. Just when you that cover, make sure you put it in a wine glass or a martini glass. Oh yeah, so it looks so fun. pretty. And you can put it in it definitely makes you feel better. <laughs> and stir it up with your little egg whisk too. Make sure you do that. We call him Mr. Mix. <laughs> okay, so just a little bit of this. Just drizzle it. Not a ton. Drizzle it over the top. And then I'm going to add some hummus. You could also add feta if you felt like you had the calories to spare. You could add feta. I'm not doing that today, but it's a possibility. I'm going to add plain old hummus. A dollop of it, two tablespoons of hummus is typically um, 40 to 60 calories, not too much. Okay, so all of this in here, this whole big salad, once we mix it all together, is going to be under 400 calories. Wow, yeah, that's a huge salad. That's certainly it's a lot. At least two people. That's yeah. great. Yeah. So, and that's what I like to keep my lunches under is around 400 calories. Um, but I also like them to be full of protein and fiber and good things for me. So a complete meal. Yeah, it's always my goal to have something to be really healthy and nutritious but enjoyable. And I would salt and pepper this too, which I have right there, so you can do that. And then Angelique's gonna try it. Alright. Excited to try it up. Mix that up. Yep, mix it up. Salt and pepper. It's my favorite. It's just different than my typical. I always do Mexican. It's just different. And it's good, and it has enough stuff in there. It doesn't just feel like a salad. It feels like this. I mean, what restaurant did we just go to? This is beautiful. Filling, it's, it's gorgeous. Try it. You'll like it. Good. You got all the stuff mm -hmm. in there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yummy. I love it. Okay. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel. I'm Angelique. <laughs> and I'm Liz. My mouth isn't full. <laughs> We're trying to sparkle. Thanks for coming by. <laughs>